Hi, this is Theo from PokerBlocks.com. Today I'm going to show you this sketchbook called Voyage Out Japan Tome 1 for Tokyo. It's a very nice sketchbook. Let's take a look at what's inside. There are actually two volumes. Volume 1 is for Tokyo and Volume 2 is for Kyoya-san. And these two books are published by Cafe Sally Inc. CFSL Inc. However, this publisher has already closed so the books are out of print if you can still find a brand new copy or second-hand copy at a good price I really highly recommend you get these two books because they are really good they are actually uh, two of my favorite sketchbooks these are actually travelog sketchbooks and the author and artist are Sandrine Garcia and Remy Menegre this book has 160 pages and this is quite a big book if you look at the size of my hand and compare it to the size of the book so for for volume one they went to Japan Tokyo and this sketchbook collects their experience records their experience so they took actually took a train from Narita Airport all the way to Ueno Keisei wherever there is because I'm not very familiar with Japan uh, one thing I really like about this sketchbook is the size because when you look at drawings like this when it's printed across two pages it really looks amazing it feels like at least for me it feels like I'm standing there looking at the scene itself and many of these drawings are really very beautiful I think it's they are drawn with watercolor some are probably pen and ink and a bit of them with color pencil another thing I like is they also visit many of the less touristy areas I mean places like Shinjuku are quite touristy but they also visit the lesser known areas and they have a little commentary very interesting commentary on the little things they see the interesting things they see the custom and how they should behave as tourists and or how people behave there in Japan these are the traditional Japanese houses and this is I think a gateway to a temple so this is the Japanese neighborhood really very cool and then there's this map here this is Ueno I have no idea where this is trains so they have all these train lines here at the bottom here you can see that every page is like a collage or a full painting and they are actually quite detailed if you look at this particular sketch here you can see all the clothes here and even for this sketch I think it's probably drawn from reference Many are actually drawn on location as well. Some are just drawn from reference. All the different types of food. The people they meet there. More neighborhoods. So this is probably drawn with pencil and graphite. So there are a lot of different styles. You can see either colored, watercolor, I think gouache, maybe, or even vector style maps. I have flipped quite a lot of pages and I'm still at page 88. The text is written in French and Japanese, but you don't really need to read it to understand what's going on. I mean, the pictures, I think they are quite explanatory. So let me just flip over to the end and let you see very beautiful even the lighting is really very awesome especially the it's very difficult to draw or paint during when the light is getting dark when the sky is getting dark so this is very well done also night scenes are very difficult challenging to paint as well so if you actually know French or Japanese, you will be able to read the captions and 
understand more about the book. If not, you can just enjoy the art for the art. That's it for volume one. These are two of my favorite sketchbooks. If you can find them at a reasonable price, I highly recommend you buy them because the artworks are very beautiful. Personally for me, I love travelogue sketchbooks. So this is, I really love this book and also volume two, which I'm going to review in a separate video. So if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, do so for more art book reviews, sketching tips, techniques, and art product reviews. See you in the next video. Bye.